All right, good afternoon, guys. Welcome to today's video. Today, I'm here at Salita Mall. Okay, I received so many requests to do boat noodle, Thai boat noodles. Okay, I'll explain what is boat noodles in a bit. Okay, let's go. All right, so uh, we actually order in batches because I don't want all that noodle to be soaked up with all that broth and all. So what is boat noodles? Boat noodles is actually uh, from Thailand, okay? These things are served on boats. Okay, so this is why the noodles are in very small portions. So when, when you're eating in a boat, right, the you know, choppy waters, the boat will shake. So it will not spill. This is why it's called boat noodles, okay? The serving size is actually quite small, so usually when someone eats, the normal guy will eat at least three or five bowls. Uh, they have two variations, one is the beef, one is the chicken, but uh, there's no pork because this place is halal. I'm not going to wait anymore, I'm going to start eating. Okay, let's go. Let's start with the ones with the bowls first. Yeah, this, this is a food item, right? That you will subconsciously just... I don't know, for me, I will end up just eating 50 bowls in, in one meal. This is not exactly very small like one cold soba. This is actually bigger. It, it's got meat, it's got meat balls, it's got a bunch of stuff in it. I got 20 bowls down. We are like 50 bowls in right now. I actually ordered a few more to like make sure that they're all fresh. Because this noodle, I think it's some sort of rice noodle, it's very easy to soak up all that broth. Okay, so um, this is why I didn't I didn't order like 100 one shot. I'm just aiming for 100 today. See if I can do it. I ran out of all the noodles, I'm gonna ask for more. If you guys are wondering, I got the chicken variation. There's two types of broth. One is the more coconutty broth. This is the more herbal base one. Sixty bowl now. I'm stacking like bowls of ten because my videographer is very scared that everything might just stop her and fall anyway to pay for all the bowls.
other food challenges that I've done, right? This one is considered relatively, I don't know, manageable because like the broth is not too oily and then the, the noodle and all, is not a lot of fatty aspects in it. When you eat, right, it's sort of like, it settles down in your stomach very, you know, like, like a very, very nicely, like gently, you know. I'm down with 100 gold. I actually ordered another 10 more bowls because like, there's still room. As compared to the first time that I did boat noodles, 100 bowls uh, took me about 4 hours or something. Okay, we're, we're 30 minutes in, uh, so I got 100 now. I, I probably won't go beyond an hour. Let's see how. Okay, they ran out of noodles. Okay, they're gonna cook up a fresh batch for me. This is my one or this is other people. I don't know, just... Okay. I'm starting to feel it, like, like the fullness right now. You hear what you just said? You said finish everything, just smash all on the floor. Alright, so we're done with the, this boat noodle challenge. Okay, uh, today I did 160 boats in an hour. Back then, uh, I think three years ago, I did 100 in like four hours. So I improved quite a lot, I think. If you guys want to try this place out, right? This place is called Original Boat Noodles. I'm at Salita Mall. Changi, they have one outlet. The other one, they have another one at Boogies as well. Okay, I'm going to link them down in the description below. So check them out. Okay, so that's it. Uh, I'm gonna end this video. I'm very stuffed right now. I'm pregnant with noodles already. Okay, that's it. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye bye. Oh!